Now, your Storm Tracker team forecast with meteorologist Ashley Renee. Welcome back everyone and happy Thursday morning. It's also the first day of winter, so saying goodbye to my favorite season fall, but winter is here, but we will have a warmer weather for the next couple of days. Now this morning it's still cold, but again, a little bit warmer than where we were earlier in the week. Our temperatures are mainly in the 40s now, 46 for Baton Rouge, 43 for Denham Springs and 43 for Slaughter are the current temperatures. Now looking outside, we have this beautiful view of the sky. These pretty clouds just uh, present this morning pretty rays of the sunshine against the clouds. But again, we have a nice day ahead, although while we're seeing sunshine for now, we'll have cloudier conditions later on as more clouds gradually build in throughout our Thursday. Now looking at the rest of today, we'll still have winds light in easterly around five to 10 miles per hour, still staying dry. Don't have to worry about your rain gear yet for today, but you will need it for this weekend. Highs will be in the upper 60s to about 70, 69 for Baton Rouge, 70 for Denham Springs and 70 for Plaquemine or today's high temps. Now again, cloud cover will gradually increase more so throughout our Thursday and still continue into Friday. Now with us having a mostly cloudy sky during the overnight hours that will help it to be a little bit warmer. Our overnight lows will mainly be in the upper 40s to low 50s. 51 is the low for Baton Rouge and 54 for Plaquemine. And then highs will be in the upper 60s to about 70 for tomorrow. Now Friday will be a mostly cloudy day. We'll have a couple of spotty showers popping up at times throughout the day and possibly still for Friday evening. But overall, most of us will likely just be staying dry and possibly for Saturday too as we have lower rain chances on Friday and Saturday, but rain chances are higher on Sunday, which of course is Christmas Eve. So we'll have showers continuing on and off throughout the day on Sunday. Heavy rainfall is also a possibility. And then by early next week, the next cold front moves through. So rain continuing through the re weekend, mainly on Sunday and Christmas Day. And then the cold front will move through early next week. And we're looking at drier conditions past Monday. Now looking at your rain chances over the next week, 20% for Friday, 30% chance for Saturday, 80% chance for Christmas Eve and 40% chance on Monday. And then we have a slight chance again on Tuesday and looking at the estimated rainfall amounts over the next week, we're around two inches for the greater Baton Rouge area. Now again, most of this rainfall will be coming in on Sunday, still continuing for Monday before the drying out period begins. Now Friday, if you have any outdoor plans, whether that's going to a Christmas event or shopping, you can still do so as we'll likely be staying mostly dry throughout the day under cloudy skies. Then a couple of spotty showers popping up on Saturday, but Sunday just periods of on and off rain continuing through the day in addition to the possibility for heavy rainfall at times. Now highs will be around 70 for today through at least Monday. Then we have that cooler air moving in behind the front again next week and highs will be in the low to mid 60s on Tuesday and Wednesday.